Hi everyone, welcome to Wiggin' with Christy. I'm Christy. Oh, I'm so excited. I bought this wig with my own funds. This is Alpha Blend by Beltress and Butterbeer Blonde. Now, many of you are probably thinking, why did you buy a heat-friendly wig? You're always telling us that you don't like heat-friendly fibers or you're, they're not your cup of tea. Well, I got Cafe Chic last month by Wig Studio One, a style by Beltress. It's heat-friendly, it's a shorter bob, and I've been wearing it, I like it. And so I decided, you know what, I'm gonna go ahead and try this new wig, because I know Beltress has been changing up their fibers. I love long bobs, you know how much I love them. And so I went ahead and bought this with my own funds. And this is the first time I'm putting it on, and I like it a lot. Oh my goodness. Um, it's the exact length I like, the cut is exactly down my alley. It's a smooth, silky, simmery, like luscious, really soft. Um, the fibers feel great on this. Um, they feel durable, but yet like human-like, which we all like to feel. And I know that's why a lot of you like the Beltress fibers is they're, they feel more natural density of fibers. Um, I still get that. now. What I love about this is Beltress has really done that lace front. Uh, they call it the creative lace front, and that's where they're putting that light color in the front. Okay, so you're not getting those dark roots. It's looking very much um, nice, and those it's coming all the way down to the lace front for those hand-tied parts, okay? So you're gonna get that looking very nice and natural with that light color there in the front. Now I have it uncrisscrossed this. Let's uncrisscross this. It's a mono part, left side. I don't know where my, um... I don't know where my wig grip is. It's probably not even parted right there. So anyway, you'll, you'll be able to see um, there. It is a pretty like wide, it can go over more this way, but I'm wanting it more this way. So you can, it's a wider part. This is new for 2021 and I got this with Wig Studio One. They had an overstock sale of like 40% off. So it's a great deal. And I just love this color. I love the way. Let's go ahead and do a spin. And then I want to talk to you about how Beltrez created this. So let's go ahead and take a look at this cat. This color is Butterbeer Blonde. The color code is 81923. It is a medium brown root with a blend of sandy blonde, ash blonde, and light blonde. It has a lace front with that light color on the front side, left mono part, no extended nape, great stretch. The ear tabs has a nice felt soft ear tab. Let's go ahead and put this back on.
It's heat for lace, so you can apply heat if you want, but I honestly do not think I'd add heat to it. I feel like it has that A line here in the front. It says sides are 13, so it's like side, seam, side, and front. But I kind of feel like it does a little bit of a, what do you guys think? I love it. It reminds me of Candace, my Candace wig a little bit. Candace has some layers in it though. This doesn't, this is like a one length. I really like this piece. Um, some sister styles I think would be as um, a Carly from John Renault, um, an L from John Renault. Um, I haven't had L from John Renault, but it's kind of like that style. Um, Sutton by Stetica Designs. That Those would be all some sister styles to this. So what do you guys think of Alpha Blend? Um, I, I really think I'm gonna keep her because I like this cut. I like this style and I love this color. So I really think I will be keeping her and praying that her ends stay good and don't get crunchy and crispy. Uh, but you know, with these hip friendly fibers, applying heat to the bell chest fibers is the best way of handling that with some either steam or straightener on those ends if they get crunchy. So I think I'm going to keep this one and do some like um, studies with this piece of how it does. I'm actually going to be ordering this in another color, which I'm excited about. It's just on back order until October and then do a comparison for you on those. So let me know down below what you think of this piece and what do you think? I got it from wigstudio1.com. Uh, so I'll link it down below with my link to them. Um, and down below in my link tree is going to be where you can get some of these accessories that I showed as well as things that I use for wigs, studio lighting, um, and home and all array of different things. I have a link tree that I have a lot of different things linked to on there. So if you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, I'd love to have your support. Click the subscribe button. If you don't follow me on Instagram, I'm wigging with Christy over there and I, I post a bunch of different stuff. I don't just post wigs. Um, but I post everything all in one. I'm one girl on Instagram um, and I do all my niches over there, if that makes sense. I don't like to separate them. I like to just be who I am and help as many women as I can. So I hope you guys have a great day. Don't forget to shine bright, love others, and be kind. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.